What's up guys, this is LXM Nadekill and today I'm showcasing Desolate. This is the second infection map I made in 4, it's the fourth map I made that I actually completed. It's a map set on St. Helios. There aren't a whole lot of infection maps set on St. Helios. And it's using a lot of the new St. Heli pieces and new overlay textures, so yeah. Feel load. Here we go. So yeah, the main area. There's like a couple different temples connected by passages. Right here, I'll show you. So, yeah, this is the main area. This is where survivors spawn. Infected will spawn on that ledge up there. You can go to a certain extent. There's there's blockers. So you can't go up over these dunes here. You can up here, but it's not the best holdout spot. You can. It's all right though. I'd suggest playing with three starting infected or four starting infected if you have a big team because this map does tend to favor survivors. So up here we got some water. It's not the best water. It's just some decal water and of course like actual the water they have it like on canvas this is much better in decal water. But it's it's alright, you know, it's got the flowing effect, it's pretty good for this. So yeah, I've got some ruins here. And this is a decent holdout spot, but just too many sides to defend from. So now I'm gonna show the main holdout. So yeah. This is the entrance to the temple. And I'm not going to show the Halo C Magnum location. That's the one thing I won't show. But, yeah, this is the main entrance to the temple. It's just a cave, mostly. Got some covenant lights to keep it lit up. And then here we get stalactites. Now you need to break through these to get into the temple. Let's see ya. Difficult to do, but let's see. Here, now I'm in here. So, yeah, got um, in the temple, got a rocket launcher right here. One thing with the new St. Healy statues that you shoot the head, will actually crack, as you can see there. Shit, I feel like ISIS right now. Blowing up old artifacts. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, this is one of the temples. And got these caves. Two ways. Same round temple at the end here. This is just probably the best holdout spot. Got some here. So you can shoot. Storm rifles work pretty good for killing infected. Here's the other cave. This one's a little tighter and more cramped. But yeah. So anyway, about these temples, I'm gonna show more of the other ones. So you got the statue, and it's round, just like most temples, or I mean St. Healy temples are round, but you did get a few like rectangular ones, and they actually weren't that hard to make. First, once you get the hang of the dirt, fairly easy. And yeah. This is one of the smallest map. This is probably the smallest map I've made, so so this video shouldn't take too long. I summed it up already. And one thing cool day two, you actually take just to the light when you get out. So yeah, it takes a second to adjust. But yeah, there's also. A what what up? I forget, forget what I actually put up on here, but on the ledge I've been. Um, ledge is a good holdout spot, but you have to be careful. Infected spawn, and it's difficult anyway. It's much easier to get up, and I have. Here we go. Up here, and up here we got a sniper.
That's what I put. I, was, I, I forgot what I put. Yeah, so this is where the infected spawn. And... Sniper spot. But be careful. It is where the alpha infected spawn, so it could be one up here. So yeah. That about sums it up. You, know, you can't get past that blocker. A blocker doesn't block machinima, it just blocks Spartans. So yeah, that about sums it up. Enjoy this video, please like and subscribe. I'll leave a download link to Hub and Halo Waypoint in the description. And I'll see you guys next time.